Hello there, it's so very nice to meet you. Welcome to the world of Pokemon. My name is Rowan. However, everyone just calls me the Pokemon Professor. This world is widely inhabited by creatures known as Pokemon. We humans live alongside Pokemon as friends. At times we play together and at other times we work together. Some people use their Pokemon to battle and develop closer bonds with them. What do I do? I conduct research so that we may learn more about Pokemon. Now, why don't you tell me a little bit about yourself? Ooh. Ooh, yep, I'm gonna be Dawn. The basic one, right? That That's me. Your name is Kiara? Okay, so you're Kiara? A fine name that is. Now this boy here, I believe he's your friend. <laughs> you believe he's my friend. What might his name be? Barry. I know him. Barry, is it? That's your friend's name? <laughs> I got to- I- <laughs> He gave me options to choose his name? That's different. <laughs> All right, Kiara, the time has come. Your very own tale of grand adventures is about to unfold. On your journey, you will meet countless Pokemon and people. I'm sure that along the way, you will discover many things, perhaps even something about yourself. Now go on and leap into the world of Pokemon. Despite the exploration team's best efforts, the rare, oddly colored Pokemon eluded detection. The rumored red Gyarados failed to appear even fleetingly to the crestfallen team. That concludes our special report, Search for the Red Gyarados, brought to you by Jubilife TV on Nationwide Net. See you next week, same time, same channel. Ooh, look at I have a Nintendo Switch. <laughs> I love when they add that into these games now. <gasps> they just add a Nintendo Switch here. It's the latest game console on Nintendo Switch. You check the PC. Pokemon Basics. People live alongside Pokemon in this world. The people that battle Pokemon are called Pokemon Trainers. The TV is turned off. Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh my gosh. This is so cute. I love the sheet. Could I have that in real life? Look at this bed. It's so adorable. Oh my gosh, I'm crying. The X button opens the menu. Bag. Uh, it says head downstairs. Well, my bag is empty. Okay options so it tells me what to do like if I'm lost it tells me what I could do oh look at my hair physics oh my gosh I'm so cute anyways you guys Kiara here playing Pokemon Brilliant Diamond for the Nintendo Switch um this game came out today you guys it came out today and I pre-ordered like in August, which is like three months ago, I pre-ordered the double pack. Looks like this. It's a box, a thick box that had both game cases in it. Okay, so I got Brilliant Diamond. Um, I ordered the double pack and gave my older brother Shining Pearl. So he's actually playing that right now as we speak. Um... Later in the game, I have the option, well, I don't, I don't, it shouldn't really be an option, I mean it's an option, but if you guys have the game, you guys could get a Jirachi, a Mew, Manaphy, and a Fione in this game, and it's really awesome. <laughs> so I'll show you guys how to do that when I get to that point, because you have to get to a certain point before you could get those. So, am I able to run? No. I'm holding the B button, but I guess that doesn't work. Anyways, 
so excited to play this game. Like I say at the beginning of every single game I ever play. <laughs> Kiara, Barry came calling for you a little while ago. I don't know what it was about, but he said it was an emergency. Okay, you just go back to your same place, okay? Why are you staring at the TV? Oh yes, Kiara, don't go into the tall grass while Pokemon might attack you. It would be okay if you had your own Pokemon, but you don't, so... Okay. This is where mom does all her delicious cooking. Here we are, it's the contest digest. The winner of today's normal rank cleverness contest is Wesley, who won with his particularly well-groomed Pokemon. That's all the time we have today. Let's meet again. Okay. Mom's favorite dessert is in the refrigerator. Ooh, what's what's your favorite dessert? Mine is ice cream. <laughs> Strawberry, specifically. Strawberry ice cream. Uh, anyways, I can't seem to run, so I guess I have to get the running shoes. Technology just blows me away. I mean, now you can play with people around the world wirelessly. Yep, that, that works. <laughs> that, that's how that works. Okay. What is this? Who are you? Listen, listen, Kiara. I want a cute Pokemon. Okay. Did you hear the Pokemon professor return to the next town over? They say he was gone for four long years. I wonder if he found some amazing Pokemon while he was gone? The Pokemon Center, always by your side. Okay, so this, I guess that little girl is my friend. I don't know her name though, but I guess it's my friend. Twinleaf Town, fresh and free. It's true that wild Pokemon do attack people sometimes. However, Pokemon also let you become friends with them. Oh, and by the way, you guys, since I also pre-ordered the uh, double pack, I get this little cute <laughs> Pokemon keychain. Still has a tag on it. It's a really cool tag, too. Like, look at this Pokemon. Anyways, I got this one in the mail. I got this one in the mail. And I got this one in the mail. Since I pre-ordered the double pack, I got all three while surprise last. So, <laughs> since I pre-ordered it way early, I got all three keychains. You're off to hang with Barry again, right? You two sure are tight. Are we? Are we tight? I don't know. Pokemart, where smiling faces gather. Okay. I thought it's supposed to be where you buy stuff. That's what it's, that's what it's supposed to be, right? Where you buy stuff. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Thud. What was that about? Oh, hey, Kiara. I'm going to the lake. You should come too and be quick about it. Okay, Kiar, I'm finding you one million if you're late. Gosh. <laughs> Just like Barry from the anime. Oh, jeez, forgot something. Gosh, we are so cute. Look how cute we are. We're so adorable. Okay, he just disappeared. Cool. Are you his mom? Barry's mom. Oh, hi, Kiara. Did you come calling on Barry? He was gone for a second, but then he came... Running right back home. He just can't sit still, that boy. I wonder who he takes after. I wonder that too. The preceding program has been brought to you by Jubilife TV. Alright, where is he? His bedroom. I'd better take my bag and guidebook too. Oh, hey, Kiara. We're going to the lake. I'll be waiting on the road. It's a 10 million fine if you're late. You have a pink bed, too. <laughs> you, <laughs> you have a pink bed? Pokemon, or smiling faces gather. You have a Nintendo Switch as well. It'd be cool if they made yours a different color. Or mine a different color. Like, you know, like the pink and green set? The Splatoon set? The Animal Crossing Switch? I don't know. Just make one of them. Hiya, Kiara. You're looking for Barry? He just went tearing off a little while ago. He's probably not gone too far. Why don't you go chase after him? I can't run, so chasing is not an option. Uh, but I'll go. Let's go. He's like right here. He's only right here. Hey, you saw that news report that was on TV, right? You know, search for the red Gyarados, the mysterious appearance of the furious Pokemon in a lake? That show got me think <laughs> got me to thinking. I'll bet our local lake has a Pokemon like that in it too. 
So that's what we're gonna do. We'll go find a Pokemon like that. Okay. How? Oh, you're following me? Okay. I don't know where we're going, but... Verity Lakefront. Okay, I, I don't want to go this way. Remember what your mother said? Kiara, don't go into the dark rooms. <laughs> Wild Pokemon might attack you. It would be okay if you had your own Pokemon, but you don't. So, okay, I guess it can't go that way. Fine. Fine, game. I'm gonna give you a fine. <laughs> Alright, what is this? Lake Verity ahead. The Lake of Emotions. Alright, to the lake. Let's find us a red Gyarados. What's going on? Ooh, it's Lucas. My rival. Professor, there's nothing out of the ordinary on the other side either. Hmm, I may have been mistaken. Something appears to be different than what than it was before, but fine, it's enough that we have seen the lake. Lucas, we're leaving. Professor, you've been gone for four years now. How are you enjoying being back in Sinnoh? Hmm, there is one thing I can say. There are many rare kinds of Pokemon in Sinnoh. The region should serve us very well in regard to our studies. Excuse me, let us pass, please. Okay. Sorry, folks. <laughs> oh, this is cool. What was that about? Those two. Huh? Kiara, let's go check this out. What's that? Don't go into the tall grass? No problem, no problem. We won't be in there long enough for a wild Pokemon to come out. Uh, if you say so. It's a briefcase? Those people forgot it here. What are we supposed to do with it? We could try to return it, but who were they? I heard them say professor. Uh-oh. Wah! The Pokemon! What's going on? Obviously they're attacking us. Ooh. Look, there are Pokeballs. Let's battle using the Pokemon in them. Which one do you want? Uh... I don't get to see first. Okay, will you choose the chimp Pokemon Chimchar? Will you choose the penguin Pokemon Piplup? Will you choose the tiny leaf Pokemon Turtwig? Okay. No, I've already decided this. I'm going with Piplup. Because I'm playing Dawn in the game, so I mean, it only makes sense. And also, I, do, I just love Piplup. <laughs> I just love Piplup so much. Ooh. I love that graphic. Oh my gosh. You encountered a wild Starly. Dawn looks awesome. Our graphics are so cool. Pound. Okay, not bad. Okay. You're gonna growl at me? Pound. Ooh. Critical hit. Your Pokemon gained experience. Fua, your Piplup totally rocked. But my Turtwig was way tougher than yours. <laughs> they were, they were other people's Pokemon. But we had to use them. Those people won't mind, will they? Uh oh. Phew! You found the briefcase. The professor would have gone through the roof if he knew he I forgot it here. Huh? What? Did you guys... Did you use these Pokemon? Oh man, how am I going to explain this to the professor? This is the professor's briefcase, so I'll take it, okay? <laughs> sure. Sure. What was that about? I don't know what's going on, Kiara. Let's get out of here. My Pokemon got hurt from that battle. If we get attacked by another Pokemon, we might be in trouble. Mine, my Pokemon did not get hurt at all. So I think my Piplup was way tougher than your Turtwig. <laughs> Alright, you go ahead. I know we have to go return these Pokemon, they're not ours. But I want to spend just a little more time with this little guy. Well then, I. so do I. Why, why do you get to stay with your Pokemon? And I don't. <laughs> 
Hey, it's those people. Is that old guy staring at us? Hmm, I heard from Lucas that you use our Pokemon. Let me see them, please. Hmm, Piplip and Turtwig. Hmm, <laughs> you like saying hmm a lot. I see, that's how it is. Lucas, I'm going back to my lab. Okay. Uh, yeah, of course, Professor, wait for me. You should visit us at our lab later, I think. <laughs> we'll be seeing you. He thinks. Okay. What was all that craziness about? I mean, if he was angry, he could have just yelled at us or whatever. And didn't he want his Pokemon back? Kiara, we should go home too. We're going home? Okay. What about returning the Pokemon? What's up, dear? Wow, I can't believe that happened to you. Am I ever glad that both you and Barry are unharmed? The professor you mentioned is most likely Professor Rowan of Sandgem Town. I've heard that he is well known for his studies on Pokemon. I hear he's also quite intimidating. Kiara, I think you need to visit him in Sandgem Town. You need to properly explain why you had no choice but to use this Pokemon. Don't worry, I'm sure he will understand. Oh, I know. Kiara, put these on. You received a pair of running shoes. Going to Sandgem Town is like an adventure in itself, right? With those running shoes, you can get to faraway places much faster. Okay, let me read the instructions. Tilt the left stick firmly to dash about faster than... Really? Put on the running shoes and blaze new trails of adventure. Well, isn't that just nifty? Okay, so... It's just the stick. So if I want to walk, I have to hardly press the stick. I don't like that control. I do not like that control. I'm used to holding the B button. Or like in Pokemon Sword. In Pokemon Sword, I didn't even have the option to just walk. Well, actually, no, it was the same thing, huh? No, it was the same control, yeah. Never mind. <laughs> but, like, in Pokemon White or Pokemon X, it would be, uh, you hold the B button to run while you walk, right? So, you run. Anyways. I mean, I do like always running places, but then what if there's actually a time when I should really walk instead of run? I don't know. Anyways, this Starly is taking a lot of hits. Who are you? Wild Pokemon lurk in tall grass. They can come bursting out at any time. So if you're wanting to battle wild Pokemon, just walk in tall grass. If you want to avoid wild Pokemon, then stay out of the tall grass. Make sense? Trainer tips, don't be shy. Talk to anyone and everyone you happen to see. By talking to people, you will get invaluable information and advice. If your Pokemon's health, its HP, is getting low, you should go home and get some rest. I should do that. But is there anything up here first that I should know about? No? Verity Lakefront. Okay. Okay. So let's go home real quick to heal because Piplup is already low HP. Okay, well, usually it's talk to your mom and she'll heal you, but I'm assuming it's you have to go to sleep. Is that not it? How do I heal? <laughs> I thought it's that that whole sleeping thing is like the way to heal. But I guess not. Could I go cook? Mom's kitchen is spotless. You can see your face on the floor. <laughs> okay, that's weird. I don't want to hear the instructions, Mom. Fine. Don't heal me. Fine then. 
All right. What does she? What does she mean about heal at your house? That I don't get. Go home and get some rest. What? Well, I can't really do that. Hi, I work at a Pokemon. Did you know that a Pokemon's health is measured by hit points, HP for short? If a Pokemon runs out of HP, it faints and can't battle anymore. If a Pokemon's HP gets low, you should heal it with a potion. Here, let me give you some potions as a sample. These ones are free. They will automatically go in your bag's medicine pocket. You obtain potions. Alright, I'm gonna try this again. Maybe I just need to stay in bed. I want to figure this out, because I know in every single adventure Pokemon game, you heal at your house. Usually your mom is the one that heals you, you just talk to her and she heals your Pokemon. But this time it says get some rest. So how long do I have to be in here for? Just listen to this music. Okay. I don't think that worked. It did not work. Alright, well, I give up. I give up trying to do that. So, she lied to me. You cannot heal at your house. That is my house, right? <laughs> I'm just like, that is my house, right? I'm having second thoughts. Oh, I have to go through the... Fine... All right, who are you? That ledge is one is one way. Jump down for a shortcut to Twinleaf Town. Okay. Hello. Hi, I've been waiting for you. Please come with me. The profs waiting to see you. See, this is our Pokemon Research Lab. We'll just go ahead and thud. What the? Oh, it's you, Kiara. That old guy, he's not scary so much as he is totally out there. Aw, oh, it doesn't matter, Kiara. I'm out of here. See you later. Wow. All right. What was that? Your friend always seems to be in such a rush. Anyway, let's go in. This game is so cute. Just gonna keep saying that. This game is so cute. Finally, you've come. Kiara, was it? Let me see that Pokemon again. Hmm, I see. This Pokemon seems to be rather happy. Alrighty then, I'll give that Piplup to you as a gift. Now that it's yours, would you like to give it a nickname? Uh, no. Your friend Barry told me what happened at the lake. I heard you battled very well despite it being your first time. And from what I can see, there is a growing bond between you and that Pokemon, though it is still young. That's why I would like to entrust you with Piplup. Am I ever glad you're kind towards Pokemon? If you weren't, well, I don't even want to think about it. <laughs> Ahem. Let's move on to the main topic. There is something I want you to do for me. My name is Rowan. I study Pokemon. First of all, I want to know exactly what kinds of Pokemon live in the Sinnoh region. To do so, it is necessary to collect data using the Pokedex. This is what I wish to ask of you. I want to entrust you with this Pokedex. Will you use it to record data on all the Pokemon in Sinnoh for me? Hmm, good answer. You obtain the Pokedex. That Pokedex is a very high-tech device. It will automatically record data on every kind of Pokemon you encounter. Kiara, I ask that you go everywhere you meet, uh, everywhere and meet every kind of Pokemon in this region. Will do. I've got the same kind of Pokedex as you. When you walked up Route 201, with your Pokemon, what did you feel? I've lived for 60 long years. Even now I get a thrill when I'm with a Pokemon. He's 60? <laughs> wow. Now, you should know that there are countless Pokemon in this world. That means there are just as many thrills waiting for you out there. Now go. Kiara, your grand adventure begins right now. The professor asked me to help, so I'm going to go out and fill the Pokedex pages too. That makes us comrades working toward the same goal. I'll teach you stuff later, okay? Okay. Nice. Ooh, I like this area. Professor Rowan invented a new Pokedex while working alongside a professor from the Kanto region. 
I'm Lucas's father. I'll be happy to assist you on your quest for the professor. Ha ha ha, I'm sure we can count on you. What is this? I don't know what that is. Anyways, we're going to start our adventure, you guys. Hey, Kiara, I want to show you a few things, so follow me. Ooh, nice music. This building with the red roof is... You call that a red roof? I mean, I guess. The building with red roof is the Pokemon Center. You can get your Pokemon healed if it's been hurt in battle. You'll find a Pokemon Center in most towns. Over here, the building with the blue roof is a Pokemon. It's a shop where you can buy and sell all sorts of items. Kiara, since you're a rookie trainer, you won't be able to buy very much stuff. Don't worry about it, okay? Oh yeah, right! Kiara, you should let your family know you're helping Professor Rowan put together his Pokédex. You may have to travel pretty far, so you should let someone know. Oh, but first, go heal up your Pokémon at the Pokémon Center. You'll be safe then. Okay, be seeing you. Ooh, I like that door. <laughs> oh my gosh, Nurse Joy looks awesome. The local club is located at the top floor of any Pokemon Center. There, you can have all sorts of fun with your friends. Talk to that nice lady at the counter and hand her your Pokemon. She'll restore your Pokemon to perfect health in no time at all. Do you see that PC over there? That fancy blue one? If you've got Pokemon with you, it's free to use. I'm very sorry, we're working underground right now. It's off limits to the public, please try it later on. Okay. And I could go upstairs. <gasps> There's an escalator. <laughs> uh, this place looks familiar. From like, Pokemon Omega Ruby. I feel nervous about going into the local room. Alright, so I never deal with any of that stuff. Online, local, I never deal with any of that stuff. So, probably never gonna go there ever again. <laughs> Just letting you guys know. Let's explore Sand Gem Town. That thing you have, it's a Pokedex, isn't it? Now you're off to see all kinds of Pokemon, lucky you. Get in the door. <laughs> I could not seem to get in the door. A good trainer is one that takes care not to let the Pokemon faint from losing HP. Pokemon grow steadily stronger from battling against other Pokemon. At first, you should heal your Pokemon regularly at Pokemon centers while you're leveling them up. Okay. What is this? Lucas's house. Are you his sister? Who are you? Oh, you're Kiara? You're doing that Pokedex thingy for the professor. Wow, that's the same as my big brother. Go for it. Ah, so that Rowan fellow is back? He's quite the remarkable man. He's been studying Pokemon since way, way back. My son and grandchild help Rowan with his studies now. Let's uh, take a peek at his room. <laughs> he has... <laughs> okay. He shares a room with his sister and they're both pink blankets. Why can't Pokemon make it pink and blue? Like, come on, Pokemon. He's a boy. <laughs> He's a boy, Pokemon. He's not a boy, Pokemon. He's a boy, comma, Pokemon. <laughs> sand Gym Town, the town of sand. Okay. Route 219. Oh wow, Pokemon are so cool, I wish I had some. You can help yours get stronger by having them battle. So I don't forget what's happened till now, I'd better save this. There, now I could take a break. Which way am I supposed to be going? I'm assuming that way. I don't know what's in 219. What's in the place 219? Route 219, what's over there? If you come across a Pokemon, you've just got to have a, a what? 
Oh, if if you come across a Pokemon you've gotta have, throw a Pokeball. Never leave home without one. If a Pokemon loses all its HP, it can't battle anymore. I'm buying lots of potions to avoid having that happen. Welcome, may I help you? I'm here to buy a Pokeball. Uh, let's start with... 10. I always have 10. Have a Premier Balls bonus. They still do that. Oh, nope. <laughs> Not one. Uh, how many potions? I have 10? Oh, she- that person gave me 10. Wow. I thought she would have given me like 2. She actually gave me 10. That's crazy. And anyways, you guys, I think that is a good place to end this video. You really ought to tell your mom that you're going on an adventure. Hold on. It's not- it's not the end of the video yet. So it's actually telling me, actually told me what to do. Okay, I like that. I like that. So I gotta tell her. How did I even forget that? <laughs> At the beginning of every game, you gotta tell your mom you're going out. Welcome home. Are you and your Pokemon healthy? Take a quick rest. <laughs> now you healed me? What's up? Wow, Professor Rowan asked you to do something that big? Okay, dear, go for it. Your mom's got your back. Oh, I know, Kiara. I've got something that you'll find useful. The guidebook. Probably. Find useful. That's a guidebook. Take a look at it. When you're curious about something or have questions during your adventure, you may find an answer. Gee, a journey full of adventure. I envy you, kiddo. Plus, you're not alone. You have your Pokemon with you. I wish I could go instead. I'm just joking. I'll be alright by myself, dear, so you go and enjoy your adventure. When you're exposed to new things and experience new sensations, it makes your mother happy too. But please come back sometimes. I would like to see all the uh, see the kinds of Pokemon you've caught. The guidebook. Useful information for your adventure will be added to this guidebook. You could check it in the bag's key items pockets. Excuse me, is my little berry here? Oh, no he's not. Oh, then he must have already left. What to do? That boy shouted about going on an adventure, then he bolted. He's so headstrong and reckless. I at least wanted him to take this. Not to worry, Kiara will deliver that to him. Won't you, Kiara? I guess. <laughs> oh, really? You do that for me? Kiara, please take this to Barry for me. You obtained the parcel. Bye bye, Kiara. Enjoy your adventure. Let me think. Knowing my boy, he would probably head straight to Jubilife City. Okay, please take that to my Barry. <laughs> to your berry. Sounds weird when you say it like that. Please take that to my berry, as in a fruit. You're forgetting something important. Am I? Yes, that hat always did shoot you well. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I'm just like, what am I forgetting? Oh, okay. Now, off you go. Now, I'm done from the anime. And that is where... Oh, <laughs> not into the sign. That is where I shall end this video. We got to Sand Gem Town, got Piplup as a partner Pokemon. And next episode, we will be going to Jubilife City. We'll be going to Jubilife City to, uh, to, uh, <laughs> what am I doing? Oh, to give Barry his parse, his parcel. His parcel. I cannot believe they let me do that. You guys know what I'm talking about, right? They let me throw a Pokeball, buy Pokeballs, before them having to teach me how to use a Pokeball. Usually at the beginning, the professor comes to you and be like, this is how you catch a Pokemon, and then he shows you him catching a Pokemon. 
And then he's like, I'll give you some Pokeballs to get started. But this time, they actually let me do it on my own. Anyways, uh, so we're here in San Gem Town. And I'll see you guys next time for more Pokemon Brilliant Diamond. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'm Kiara. If you like this video, give this video.